Haru Nomura on the other side is hanging on by her toes here. Very tight on this bunker. She does have this gap though where she can chip it and let it run around to the flag. She needs to settle though and check. This is an exceptionally good shot. Oh, that was awesome. How about that? Went from up and down safe to nearly a birdie make. Look at that scrappy lie there. Needs to make sure the contact's perfect. Low ball flight just to the left of the flag. Staying out there a fair way though. Oh, if it comes off that bank, it'll be okay. Working its way back down. Pretty good result from where that drive could have been. This would be some birdie. Yeah, take advantage of a good break. And she didn't miss too many of these the first two days. I'm expecting to see this go very close. Oh, thank you very much. Very calm. A really lovely putting stroke, kind of quite buttery, if you will. Yeah, as you smooth the silk, isn't it? It's just incredible. And not a lot of room for movement here. Nice big deep bunker. And she's got to be careful again of this downslope off the back of the bunker as well. Wind howling right to left. Just gets it out, catches the downslope. Look, it was such a difficult spot to be. Haru Nomura is going to be the next to go. They're pretty much on a similar level. 94 metres for Haru. Just a wedge. Gives herself a little bit better angle being out on this left-hand side. There's no bunker to contend with. She can just take this straight in. Gives herself more of a cross breeze as well. So again, it's going to have to be well right of the flag. And in this wind, be brave enough to get it back there because you only leave this short and down on the front level. Punches it low, punches it right. It's coming back on the flag. It looks good. Yeah, that's uh, yeah, that's really very good. well done, Mary. Yeah. Use your imagination a little bit there. Welcome back to the Vic Open. It was a good approach shot at eight for Nomura. Coming off back-to-back -back bogeys. Now three behind the lead of Kim Kaufman. Well, very nicely done. Nice way to bounce back. That closes the lead to only two. Haru Namura with this tricky shot. Try and get up and down to stay at 11 under. Might not hold on. Just stops on the fringe. Really difficult there. It was a pretty good pitch shot that Haru played there, but it was such an awkward spot to be. So this is for par from just off the edge. That would have been such a good par. But it's going to be another drop shot. We're having a little bit of sort of uh, picking up one, dropping one, picking up one, dropping one. But it's that sort of day. As we head back to the par three, 12th, and Nomura. Oh, Haru almost with a two. There's Haru Nomura. Just to stay within two. Oh, dear, Haru. So she lipped out for two, lips out for three, and takes four at the par three twelfth, and she does indeed drop two back. She plays in her off seasons as well. And Namura continues to fray a drop shot. This needs a high fade on it for Namura here. Something soft. This is a big putt for Haru Nomura with Kim Kaufman in trouble, bound to drop at least one. 
she could have picked up two there. Okay. Still, I don't think too many people would argue with a par out there at 14 today. It's ranked the fourth hardest hole on the golf course.